Today I am going to show you how to record yourself in Zoom. So we're going to start by going to alaska.zoom.us and once you get to this screen you just want to sign in. Sign in with your Alaska username and password. So what we want to do first is get our settings right. And now that you're in the Zoom program, on the left side of the screen there are all these different menu items. You want to go to Settings, click on that, and next you want to go to Recording because we want to set up our recording settings. You want to set it up so you have an active speaker, so you want to have this top box checked because it's going to show your screen and then a little picture of yourself when you record. Leave the rest of these unchecked. Next you want to go to meetings and then to your personal meeting room. So this is where you would normally start a meeting with someone else but this time you're going to have a meeting with only you in it. We'll next hit start meeting and we'll just go through the screens. We'll open the Zoom meeting and you'll see this box come up and this is just just as if you were going into a regular Zoom meeting. So a couple things you want to do there's a little microphone and a camera here. The microphone next to it there's a little up arrow. If you click on that it'll allow you to select your microphone and you can see I have a number of microphones I can check on. I'm going to continue to use the headset that I'm currently wearing. And then you can also select speakers. And it's the same thing with the video. And right now you can see my video is turned off because it's got this line through it. If I click on this button, the video will start. And now you can see me. The arrow for the video can go up and you see I have a couple different options there also but I'm going to continue to use the webcam I'm currently using. Okay so now you are ready to record your presentation and the first thing you're going to want to do is bring your PowerPoint up. Here's my PowerPoint presentation. Again once your PowerPoint presentation is up then go ahead and click down here on the on the blue button and you'll see here's where I'm recording and down at the bottom in the middle this green button is to share your screen and that is exactly what you want to do. This is what you would do to share with somebody else but in our case we're just going to share it so that we can record it. So we're going to share screen and as you can see I've got a number of things open. It, it'll make your life a lot easier if you don't have so many tabs open. Once we selected it we just hit the share button down here on the bottom right. Uh, one tip, if you have sound in your PowerPoint, um, you're going to want to click on this button that says Share Computer Sound. So let's go ahead and share. And now you can see at the top of the screen, we have all our options. So before we start to make it a polished presentation, I'm going to go ahead and go to Slideshow and from the beginning. And now you can see that we are ready to present. Now to start recording, you just go up here to more on the top right and come down to where it says record. Once we do this, you'll hear the this meeting is being recorded. Okay, so now I'm sharing. I'm doing my my presentation. You might want to practice a few times just to make sure it's a smooth transition. And then you just go through your slides just like you normally would. Okay, now my slide is done and I'm going to go down here and stop recording and I'm going to say yes. The recording has stopped. At this point we're done with the recording, we're done with the PowerPoint and we can stop sharing so let's go ahead and do that. That's this red button up at the top menu bar. Stop share and when you're done then you just go down here to the right you can end the meeting and just say end meeting for all. 
And so now all we have to do is retrieve the PowerPoint presentation that we just made. And let's let's just go back to our Zoom meeting. And again, we hit recordings. There's my recording, and I'm going to go ahead and click on it. Here's my recording here, and we can look at our video by clicking on it. Okay, so now I'm sharing. Okay, and that seems to be working. So now we can go back out, and then you just download your file. Okay, so now we're in the course in Blackboard and here's the assignment, PowerPoint assignment, and uh, so I'm supposed to create a PowerPoint and upload it, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the file, and here here is my download in my download folder, and I'm just going to grab that with my mouse, click on it, and drag it down if you have these dotted lines here, that means you can drag and drop your assignment right into it. I've drug it down. I'm just going to let go. And you can see right here, here's the assignment. It's all ready to go. And I'm going to go ahead and submit that. And that's it. You have completed the assignment. Thank you very much.